want to encourage somebody out there who's thinking about quitting, you're thinking about giving up, this is for you. You're going through a tough time. Maybe you're walking through real depression. Maybe you are in a valley today that you've experienced the worst failure of your life and you are on the verge of giving up. Maybe you're here today and your marriage is on the rocks. Maybe you're here today and you're dealing with anxiety on a daily basis. You know what it's like to be in a lonely, dark place. You know what it's like to want to quit. You know what it's like when the pressure's overwhelming, when people expect your best, but you're at your worst. That is a moment of choice. That is a moment of decision. What will your response be? Are you gonna sit back or are you gonna step up? Don't give up. Don't give up. Stay in it. Stay focused. Adversity creates the perfect moment for audacity. It's in your adversity. The thing that comes out of you is what defines you. When life is squeezing you and pressure is on you, what's really inside of you? When life knocks on the door, when you go through some stuff, when you get a bad diagnosis, that's when you have to pull on your faith. That's when you have to be resilient. If it feels kind of dark all around you right now, I want to remind you, it is always the darkest before dawn. And dawn is coming. You've got to be willing to go against the tide. You've got to be willing to harness your will and say, in spite of this, I'm in control here. I'm not going to let this get me down. I'm not going to let this destroy me. I'm coming back. You can decide that you're going to stand up to life. You must have faith. You've got to believe in yourself. You've got to believe in your abilities. You've got to believe in your service, your company, your ideas, unquestionably. You've got to have faith, and that faith gives you patience. That is not going to happen as quickly as you want it to happen. But you've got to keep moving and keep plugging away. If people ask and say, how are you doing? Even if you're having some difficult times, say, I'm blessed and highly favored because anytime you wake up and you don't have a white chalk outline around your body, it's a great day. And so I say to you, it's possible you can live your dream if it's becoming a diamond, if it's having more, if it's achieving more, if it's being a better father, being a better mother, whatever it is, overcoming addiction, changing our society, it's possible you can live your dream. It's necessary that you have a plan of action, that you're resilient, that you stick to, and you work with the system, that you work with people, that you give support, and that you be there for them, that you have the vision and never give it up, that you become creative and relentless and keep on...